in summary, and I know people have been here a long time, very appreciative of everyone attending. I think we've seen a really strong investment over the past three years in public transport. We've also seen a strong investment in roads um, and some of the tolls and tunnels that Sam doesn't like. But I believe, and the Victorian Labor government believes, they're necessary to keep Victoria moving and continue delivering for Victoria. I think the Melbourne Metro Rail project will be transformational across Victoria and deliver benefits locally on both the Frankston and the Sandringham line, as well as improvements to South Yarra Station and the network generally. I think there's issues around inclusivity, I think there's issues around buses, but I think the past three years have shown what a good government can do in investing in public transport, um, and I think it's critically important, whoever wins in the November election, that the local MP can be an effective advocate in that government to make sure that Pran continues to get and deliver activities. And, you know, the advocacy and campaigning and the work locally is critical because while you can mention things in Parliament and you can table position, uh, petitions, the Greens in the lower house have submitted no cross-party budget bids on transport projects locally in Pran through the budget process for the past three years. So, you know, it's one thing to talk, it's another thing to deliver, and it's really important for Pran that we have an effective MP. And I think the journey that Labor has commenced around public transport is one that needs to continue.